Hey, welcome back to another Trick Tip Tuesday. And today I'm gonna to talk about an easy way to mark your bin locations on a tube. That way, when you're running through your bins, you can rotate and clock your tube in any direction and still be able to find your bin mark uh, on your tube. So uh, before I get to that, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, and please send us an email to our tips at tricktools.com email. And give us your ideas for tips that we can include in these Trick Tip videos and uh, we'll see what we can do to get those added. So um, now on your tubing, uh, you know, when you're gonna mark out your bin locations, say you have multiple locations. Uh, we got this one here, that was the first bend. Uh, let's go ahead and say you have another one here. And typically you'd mark this out with a tape measure, you know, string your tape on here, mark uh, the measurements of how and where you need your bin locations. Say you put a couple of lines on here because you're doing multiple bends. So typically, as you run this through the machine, when you get to your next bend, say you have to clock the tube one way or the other, rotate it around uh, to be able to you know, fit whatever you're trying to do. Um, when you rotate it around, your bend marks then get rotated to the other side of the tube. And if you forgot to maybe measure or mark uh, a couple more bend lines in those locations, uh, you can have to come back and remeasure. So an easy way to get around that is to cut a piece of tubing that will fit over the tubing that you're trying to bend. Slide that on there. So when you get your bend mark on there, say you've got it lined out, you can line up your piece of tubing and trace all the way around the tube. Gives you a nice straight line, as long as you have a nice straight cut on your uh, piece that slides over there. Then you can Slide this one over, mark around the tube here. And that's an easy way to put your bend location uh, 360 degrees around the tube. That way as you slide it through the machine to the next bend, you can rotate this any direction and still know exactly where your bend mark is and be able to bend it accurately in the right location. So it's a quick, easy way to be able to mark all the way around the tube and accurately um, as long as I said, as long as you've cut this piece nice and straight and true. So um, hopefully that tip can help you out on uh, clocking your bends uh, in your bender when you're working on a multiple bend part. So um, yeah, so that's uh, this week's trick tip. Send us an email, tips at tricktools.com. Give us your tip ideas and uh, we'll include them in the next couple videos. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next week.